Alright, so I'm going to make this video one time and one time only for you, Tony. You sit there and say that I'm all this shit. You believe all the troll shit. For what reason? I mean, it's funny how you sit there and say that I'm a pedophile and this and that, but yet you have literally been proven to take pictures of underage girls' asses at a fucking mall. You got caught with child porn on a USB drive, and you openly admitted to liking girls that look underage on a live stream a couple years ago. But yeah, I'm the pedophile, right? But yeah, you've actually done real pedo shit, dude. The real pedophile here ain't me. It's yo ass, bro. You're the pedo. Not me. And it's funny, you sit there and believe their lies about how I supposedly steal music. But here's the thing, bud. Here's what you need to realize. They steal my shit. I don't steal theirs, dude. You're siding with a bunch of fucking loser-ass liars. Which, which, hey, it's cool. You know, if you want to be known as a piece of shit. And a fucking asshole and a little bitch. And an internet bully, then by all means. Be on your way with your new friends. By all means, be on your way with your new friends. But you know, there's an old saying, Tony, that rings very true. Show me your friends, and I'll tell you who you are. Show me your closest friend, and I'll tell you where your future lies, and where it's headed. See, Tony, when you hang out with losers like them, you yourself become a loser. When you hang out with assholes, you're going to become an asshole. You hang out with the wrong crowd like them, you're going to end up getting screwed over. Now, I don't know how many times I have to stomp it into your brain. But I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to do this one last time. And you need to fucking learn. Okay? When you hang around these fucking people, you're allowing yourself to be fucked with. And I'm going to tell you this one time, Tony. Shut the fuck up and leave me alone. Because you act like you know me, but you really don't. See, that's the problem with people like you, Tony. People like you think that I'm this bad guy, but I'm really not. I mean, have you ever once sat down to actually fucking talk to me? Have you ever once sat down and considered... Oh, maybe these people are stealing from him. Maybe these people are doing this now. When I have shown multiple times that these people steal my music, they steal shit from me, and they do shit that's wrong. And when it comes to free-for-profit instrumentals, I'm allowed to use whatever instrumental I want, as long as it's within the realm of free-for-profit or non-profit. Well, not non-profit, but you know what I'm saying. Free for profit use or non-copyrighted instrumentals. Which means, as long as I am transformative, and this is how fair use works. As long as you are transformative with over 75% of a track, then it falls under fair use. When I record my vocals over top of an instrumental, I do tweak the instrumental just a little bit. I tweak the instrumental about 10%, whether that's slowing it down, adding an effect, or something of that nature. And then, 
I lay my vocals over top of it for the other 90%. And then to finish off, to add to my vocals, I add effects and stuff like that as needed. Therefore, I am not breaking any rules. I am not breaking any terms of service. It is called fair use. What these people are doing, Tony, is blatant theft. And everyone with a half a brain can see that. Why can't you see that, man? Why can't you see that what they're doing is stealing from me? They're making up shit to attack me. Why can't you see that, Tony? Stop being blind, dude. Wake the fuck up. Take a look around, man. And don't just take their word for it. When when you ask them a question, don't take their word for it. Really dig in. Do your fucking research. Okay? Don't just sit there and be like, Oh, well, th- this is my song. Th- th- blah, blah, blah. No. Really dig in and do your research. Gather proof. Ask them when they made the song. How they made it. What program they used. Because you know what's funny? Not one of them can answer that, but yet I can. I can name off every single song I've ever recorded and what program I used. And the dates that they were recorded and released. But yet they can't do that. Don't that sound kind of funny to you, Tony? The fact that they cannot name off any of that shit. But yet I can like it's nothing. Gee, I wonder why. It's because I'm the original author of all the songs that Edward Boy and William Glory Hole steal from me. I'm the original author. I know when they were recorded. I know what date. I know what programs I used. All of that. But yet they can't name off a single one. I guarantee it. So Tony, this is my final warning to you. If you're going to hang out with these people, then leave me alone. But if you want the real truth, come over here to our side, man. I'll show you the real truth. I'll show you what's actually going on. I have zero problem with that. I have no problem showing you the real fucking reality of what's actually going on. Because trust me when I say there's a lot of fucking people that actually know what's really going on. So I seriously urge you, Tony, find better friends. Don't hang out with these losers. Because all these losers are going to do is drag you down, man. That's all they're going to do is drag you down and make you look worse than what you already do. Pick better friends. It might do you some good.